But we're going to begin with breaking news from Sterling Heights, where state inspectors have just shut down the carnival rides at Jeepers of Lakeside over safety concerns. This is a popular spot in Macomb County for kids' parties, and it's right inside Lakeside Mall. But the state says four of the rides at Jeepers just aren't safe. We bring in Larry Spruill, who's live at Lakeside with this long list of safety violations. Larry. Good evening, Devin and Karen. We're talking about a list of multiple violations, like missing parts from the equipment and not having proper inspection documentation inside Jeepers. Now, we were asked to stay off the property, but take a look. You can see Jeepers has a very strong mall security presence outside, inside and outside the mall as well. But tonight, nobody will be enjoying the rides at Jeepers. It's known as the place to be for kids' birthday parties. Jeepers is a very popular spot here at Lakeside Mall, known for its children rides. But Friday, those carnival rides are shut down and in trouble. Licensing and Regulatory Affairs, or Laura, tells Local 4 the rides here at Jeepers are unsafe. And right now, Laura is ordering the popular children's spot to cease operations immediately due to multiple safety violations of state law on several rides like Banana Squadron, JJ's Driving School, Python Pit, and Yak Attack. I learned there are multiple violations at the Jeepers Lakeside Mall location. We're talking about missing parts, cracks in equipment, leaking hydraulics, unsafe lap bars and latches, dysfunctional controls, joints and covers, and lastly, failure to inspect and document inspections. I reached out to Laura, a spokesperson released this statement. Carnival rides in Michigan are held to the highest safety standards to keep riders safe. Laura inspects permitted amusement rides annually. However, ride operators are required to conduct daily inspections before operation according to manufacturer criteria, national standards, and state law. And we did try to get an inside look at Jeepers inside the mall, but we were asked again to leave the property. Meanwhile, I did ask mall management for an on-camera interview or a written statement. They declined both of those options. We're live tonight. Larry Sproul, Local 4.